everyone, it's Mario Princess, your favorite redhead gamer girl, and today I'm going to show you how to add cool gifts and sounds to your channel point redemptions in under five minutes. The only thing you're going to need for this tutorial is Streamlabs OBS and you're going to need a PC. That's what I'm using right now. If you would like to add some cool animations or sounds to your channel points for free, keep watching. So the first thing you're going to want to do is go to the Mix It Up app. Com. So this is the program that you're going to be installing so that you can play the animations and the sounds on your stream. So you're just going to go down and um, download the installer or the zip version. I did the download installer. Some people do the download zip version. To me, it doesn't really matter. And then once you download it, you're going to want to sign in, log in as a streamer. I don't think it'll show this at the very beginning. So you're just going to want to say new streamer and then put in your credentials. So once you're able to get into the Mix It Up program, you're now going to open Streamlabs OBS. So run it as an administrator as you would usually do. And then go back to the Mix It Up app once Streamlabs OBS is open and go to the Services tab. You're then going to want to connect your Streamlabs OBS to your Mix It Up app. You can test the connection, all of that. So this is only going to work as long as your Streamlabs OBS program is running. So once that's all good and ready to go, you're then going to want to go to the Channel Points tab. So once you're in the Channel Points tab, you can either add command to existing rewards or you can create a new Channel Point reward. So if you already have your command made in your Twitch creator dashboard, all you have to do is add command and then right here you can then go through and select one of the commands you already have. I have a million commands as you can see, but the one I wanted to do was the giveaway raffle ticket. So you can just push that. But anyway, since I already have it made, I'll just go through it right now. So I'll just go through edit command and you're going to see that I have four actions right here. I'll go through that in a second, but make sure you unlock this command first. I think it would be closed. And so you're going to add these actions in this order. You're going to do the streaming software, the sound, the weight, and then the streaming software. So for the first streaming software, you're going to want to put it Streamlabs OBS and source visibility and then click visible. So what you're going to want to do now, you're going to want to open up your Streamlabs OBS. There's me. Hello. And what you're going to want to do is you're going to want to go to your sources right here and then add a media source. So you'll add media source. So if you want your channel points to have a GIF, you're then going to add a GIF right here in your media source. So I already have the golden T already selected. That was what I was going to use. So you would just add a new source if you wanted to. I have the golden T right here. And so it'll just upload as a regular GIF. You'll see local files, restart all of this. But when you upload it, make sure that you click this I thing as invisible. That is super important. So once you're there, um, you're gonna put that source name that you had just added, mine was called Golden Tea, right here. The next one is your sound. So you're gonna wanna upload the sound. The sound has to be separate than your GIF. So you'll just do a browse file and then just go through all of the different sounds that you have already and you'll just add it. Mine was this one and so it'll be there. And then you can also test it too. Sheesh, someone <laughs> got a ticket. Yeah, that was the one I had. All right, so once that sound is uploaded, you can then adjust the volume. Let me actually make this bigger. That might be easier for you to see. The next one is going to be the wait time. So the wait time is about as long as how long your sound file is. Mine was about four and a half seconds, so I put five seconds here. And then lastly, you're going to want to put this, the same thing you had up here, streaming software. You're going to do it down here. So Streamlabs OBS, source visibility, what mine was, golden tea. But this time, you're going to keep this not turned on. So this one at the top is turned on, this one's at the bottom. Now it's really important when you look at it from Streamlabs OBS, let me pull that up for you. So when you're on Streamlabs OBS, down here it's automatically turned off. When you test the command, Sheesh, someone you'll, got a ticket. You'll see how this becomes visible and then becomes invisible. So this is really, really important. It's really part of the entire sequence. So make sure this is marked as visible. This one's marked as invisible. And then you can test it out 
on Streamlabs OBS once someone redeems that channel point. But that's exactly how you do it. I hope this was a really simple and easy tutorial. If this worked for you, give this video a big thumbs up. If you have any questions, leave some questions in the comment section below. And if you enjoyed this video, make sure to subscribe to the channel. My name is Anoy Princess, and I hope you all have a wonderful day.